Claustrophobia Claustrophobia An intense fear of confined or enclosed spaces. It is more common in females than males and can most develop in childhood and adolescence. Many fears seems reasonable but a phobia is an intense and irrational fear toward the situations. So, the level of the fear doesn't match the actual danger presented by the feared situation. It becomes health and social issues when the fear interferes with the ability to carry out daily activities including working efficiently, and impacts on the relationships and self-esteem. Symptoms. Similar to those in anxiety and a panic attack. Tightness in chest or rapid heartbeat. Upset stomach, sweating, shaking, numbness or tingling. Dizziness, tinnitus, dry mouth. Crying, tantrum, freezing, clinging, especially in children, fear of dying. Triggers. Elevators, transportations, trains, airplanes, small cars, tunnels, caves, cellars. MRI machines, small rooms without windows or with windows that can't be opened. Thoughts about being in a confined space. Treatment, exposure therapy, desensitization therapy, gradually and repeatedly exposed to the feared situation that makes feel comfortable in the situation. Cognitive behavioral therapy. A uh, talk therapy that focuses on managing the phobia by changing the way to think, feel, and behave. Discussing the symptoms and describing the feeling, and then learning how to keep the mind and body calm. Drugs for a short period of time benzodiazepines, alprazolam, clonazepam, diazepam, valium, selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, paroxetine, escitalopram. 